Hey guys, today I am telling you something that's gonna change your life. I'm gonna tell you about our check mark and kit of the day system. It reduces fights and we keep track of, well, everything with it. It's awesome, you just, just you'll see. Hey guys, I'm Brittany and today I'm telling you about the check mark and kit of the day system. It's kind of a mouthful, but it's amazing. You will see why. Okay, so I have tried so many chore charts and reward systems through the years. I mean, dozens and dozens probably. And for some reason, we could just never stick with one for very long. It just was too complicated or too much for me to keep track of. I couldn't figure out what would work better for us. And one day I kind of just condensed all the things into the literally the simplest method I could possibly conjure up. And it became the check mark system. I have shared this with people, other people love it. And now I'm sharing it with you because who needs an easier life as a mama? Raise your hand. I know I do. Okay, so one great thing about this system is you can really let your kids keep track of it for you. I really don't do it at all anymore, and it's on the honor system. So if I caught one of my kids lying about it, obviously they would lose privileges for quite a long time, but they keep each other accountable as well. So I love it when I don't have to be the one to keep track, right? Who wants to put their chart or their kids in charge of more and like delegate it out? Yeah. Okay, so here's how the check mark system works. This is how we keep track of our kids' allowance, their rewards, and even discipline, all the things in one spot. So our kids get an allowance every week, and it's really based on doing the chores that are required of them. Plus, they help me out a lot with the baby that I keep every day, and I pay them what they're worth, basically. And if they do extra chores throughout the week or I'm needing help on extra projects, then they can earn extra check marks. So in our household, a check mark is worth $1. I really just did that because it was the easiest thing to do. You can totally do it a different way if you want to. But when I'm handing out a check mark for a chore, I have to make sure that chore is worth a dollar to me. So a lot of times I'll bundle a few chores together because I'm like, I am not paying you $1 to take up your clothes from the stairs. You know, that sort of thing. So on Fridays, we give our kids their check marks if they've earned them for the week, if we haven't had any issues. I definitely reward them with extra ones for going above and beyond, for doing extra jobs for me, and I even discipline them sometimes by taking one away. If they have hit their sibling or just really done something they shouldn't have done, I will even threaten with it sometimes, I don't know, maybe. But basically, if they've done their morning and evening chores and they have been good all week, they get their weekly allowance on Fridays and they get their check marks. And I'll get into what morning and evening chores are later, but it's something they have memorized. We don't have to have a list of it anymore. So you may be wondering, what is kit of the day? What is this extra magnet over here? So we actually rotate this through our kids' names and each day, one of the kids is the kid of the day. Now, kid of the day, is a concept I got from Jordan Page over at Fun Cheaper Free. Go follow her if you don't, she's amazing. She's just rocked my world. Um, so kid of the day is gonna help you have less fights in your house. Who needs less fighting? Oh my goodness, me. Okay, so kid of the day gets to push elevator buttons. They get to pick what we're eating for lunch, if it's an option. They get to choose the movie that we watch, the music in the car. They get to pray at dinner time. All the things that my kids usually would argue about, or if I even just hear one breaking out, I'm like, uh, who's kid of the day? Problem solved. End of discussion. And anytime they've had issue with that, I'm like, hey, if you are fighting with the kid of the day on their day, then we're not gonna respect your day when it comes around. So, kid of the day has been amazing in our house. We've been doing it for like five years and I swear to you, it's a life changer. So another thing that we use kid of the day for, and I don't do this every single week, but the kid of the day on some weeks gets to stay up an extra 20 minutes past their bedtime and just have some special time with mommy. Daddy's at work in the evenings in our household, so it is just me spending some one-on-one -on -one quality time 
with each child because sometimes in a bigger family, I know they can start feeling yeah. like they never get that one-on-one. -on -one. They never get to talk with me alone. Uh, Little baby voices in the background. Uh, <laughs> so this is a really great solution for you to just help your kids have time to share with you what's going on in their world and just to really fill up their love cup, right? So I love that part of it. I probably do that about once a month and it's really special time. And sometimes we just watch a show together. Sometimes, you know, we really just do whatever they want to do. I ask them, what do you want to do with mommy tonight? So they love it. It's their favorite thing and I love it too. Okay. So you may notice we don't have any chores written out on this chart. The reason for that is we have a morning chart and an evening chart and it's actually something I used to have laminated on the fridge and we've been doing it for so long now that we misplaced those a long time ago, don't even know where they are, but everybody knows what's on the, the list. We've memorized it. So what we do for morning checklist is you get dressed, you make your bed, you brush your teeth, you put away your laundry because I always have clean laundry for them like on the stairs or on their dresser when they wake up in the morning. That's just my routine personally. Then their evening checklist is you take a bath and get ready for bed, you brush your teeth again, you clean your room. And I do mean clean. Like I like things to be clean in our house when we go to sleep so we can wake up to a fresh, nice, clean house. So there's other things that I've added in as they've gotten older. They all now have to unload the dishwasher as well right before breakfast time. And Ben always takes out the trash, things like that. But those are just kind of like, I let them know when they need to do it. They know it's their job to do. Anything above and beyond their usual chores usually constitutes an extra check mark. But of course, we definitely encourage going the extra mile in our household and not always expecting to be compensated for that. So if I just see that that's an issue in somebody's heart, that they're being a little greedy with their service towards their family, then that's something that we'll work on and maybe not reward with a check mark for every extra batch of chores. <laughs> so. Maybe you're asking, why do you use the check marks for allowance and money? You guys, I was giving my kids cash for a while. First of all, I don't always have cash, so that's kind of inconvenient in and of itself. And then they were losing it and they were mixing it up and saying, it's mine, no, it's mine. Like I left it on the dresser, you didn't put your money there. All kinds of confusing things were happening. I know kids love piggy banks. I know, I know, trust me, but I just couldn't handle the piggy bank thing anymore. So I was like, you know what? On your bank now, the check marks represent what you have. If you know you have four check marks and we're in line at the store and you want to spend two of them on M&Ms and a soda, sure, they're your check marks. I'm paying with my debit card. And by the way, I do charge them tax. <laughs> and it's so easy. They don't have to say, oh, I forgot my money or I'll pay you back later. We just take check marks off, put check marks on. It has been the easiest system, hands down, that we have ever used for rewards, for allowance, for discipline. It's just so easy. So that is our checkmark and kit of the day system. Comment down below if you're gonna try it out and let me know what you think. I'm hoping it changes your world like it changed mine. Bye guys, see you next time.